Nityan Dam, I welcome you back with my love and respects and the blessings of my Guru, His Divine Holiness, Bhagwan Shri Nityananda Paramashivam. In today's video, I want to talk about how to handle abusers and what is the right cognition to have towards any form of abuse in life. Abuse happens from a space of zero gratitude. And like I mentioned in some previous videos, gratitude is the experience from the Sahasrara. So when you don't have gratitude, you are the total opposite of Sahasrara, which is the Patala. So there's, we know seven chakras from the Muladhara to the Sahasrara, but these are the seven upper layers, upper planes. There's also seven layers below that go all the way down. So we have 14 layers and uh, the 14 vertical planes of existence. Uh, rotate, uh, they, all of these planes are, are centered on a standila, on a center, and they operate. So when you see somebody in the space of abuse, be very clear, they are not operating from any form of gratitude. So when there is no gratitude, that means they are in the worst space, which is the patala, the lowest frequency. I cannot say worst, but I mean, I guess maybe you like that one, but uh, most likely not. <laughs> so the worst space is patala. It is the space where everything is matter of pure powerlessness and uh, everything is a uh, very dark is dark. That's why we call it darkness. And uh, then there's no gratitude. There's no higher frequencies. There's no powerfulness. There's no um, all the auspicious things are not radiating in the space of the the auspicious qualities are not uh, radiating when you operate from the space of Patala. So when you see an abuser, you don't need to engage with them because they're operating from a space of Patala. They're already operating from the worst space possible, a space where there's no gratitude. It's like Buddha was saying, I, because I read a lot of stuff about Buddha before meeting Swamiji, Buddha was saying, when somebody's angry, he will not go to hell. He's already in hell. Being angry is hell. <laughs> All these lower spaces, it's already hell. He's not going to go anywhere. He's already deep, deep in it, neck deep in it. So you don't need to worry about it. If you just start to fight with that or engage with that, it's just a waste of your time, life and energy. If you spend your life, time and energy to engage with somebody who is established in the space of Patala, that will only bring you there. So you don't need to engage with them. You just stay in that space of gratitude and keep moving in that direction and make decisions from that space. So guru-disciple relationship is for that. It is for you to constantly operate from a space of gratitude and not to go down to the space of Patala and start to make decisions from the space of Patala, which is the worst space. That's why it's called Patala. So with the, I'll see you guys in another episode with this Nityananda. Be blissful. I welcome you all with my love and respect. Let you all open all your three eyes. Ooh.